So why have you chosen to remember Odata this way? Um, you know, actually, I'm really happy and glad that I, I got the opportunity to sing for Dada. It is really the, the highest privilege to sing for someone who's done so much for our country and who has laid his life for this country. Him and his peers, 27 years in jail is no joke. I don't even know if I'll be able to, to do 24 hours. Um, so it is really my honor. Hmm. Uh, tell us a bit more about that encounter with the Dada Nelson Mandela. Well, it was very brief. I, I performed for him. It actually was his 84th birthday. I was not um, in the industry yet at the time. So, um, and I got a standing ovation for my performance. It, I performed a song that I've never released because it was a song in progress that I, <laughs> I later um, wasn't so happy with. But to have gotten the honor to perform for him and to shake his hand that day, I'm sure he, he never remembered me after that. But uh, for me, that moment will stay with me forever. I know artists are very, very critical of themselves. So I bet that song wasn't <laughs> half bad. Are you ever going to release it just in, in well, memory? Um, well, I, I, I really don't think so, you know. <laughs> I, I, I don't even remember um, half what the lyrics um, said. Yeah. But you remember that moment for a lifetime. I remember he had that presence, for a lifetime. didn't he? he? He also stood for me and clapped as well. Yes. Very few people can say I got a standing ovation from Udata Nelson Mandela. Well, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, uh, tonight's performance, uh, what is it, what, what's going to be on offer today? How are you going to choose to remind uh, South Africans of this great statesman? Well, you know, music has been a big part of, uh, of, of the struggle. Um, you, you, you saw even at the stadium yesterday, people were singing. Mm -hmm. And I remember, you know, people used to ask back in the day, if you, if you guys are going through such a hard time, why are you singing and dancing? Yeah. They didn't get that, you know, music gave us hope for, for a new day. And that is why music is very close to our hearts as South Africans. So we hope that we can give that a proper send off. Um, you've seen him dance as well, the Madiba dance, the famous Madiba dance. So we hope that we can give him a proper send off as artists as well and, and just um, also say that, say thank you, Dada, for, for us being able to be here today. There's so much that we couldn't have done without that 1994 moment. Mm -hmm. Indeed. We'll talk more about music being a sign of the times and translating the emotions of the people, a go-between, if you can, between the leaders and the people on the ground. We'll do that in just a moment, but let's quickly hop over back to Port Elizabeth uh, to see what's happening there. We have my colleague Viewe standing by. Viewe, I tried to cross you a little bit earlier. I know you were...